care to play? Everybody, welcome back to my channel. My name is Spooky Cat, and this is Fancy Drew Secrets Can Kill. So the last place we left off was we got into this fucking library, <laughs> as you can see by the name of the save, and we got a whole frig ton of clues and stuff. I had written some in a book. Actually, my book is right here. I think we'll grab it. Um, which I'm still confused about, but I think I might know where to start. Um, unfortunately, my phone with the pictures and everything, uh, died on me recently, so I have to go back and, uh, I have to just manually do them or take them with the phone that I'm using right now, so. But the thing I wanted to look at is if it's in here yeah it's this okay so i was trying to figure out what this is because i wrote it down in my book um where where is it i hear somebody walking around it doesn't matter anyways so this where it says if any th thing happens to me s-e-a-r seer but then I realized that why would they have these other letters here if they didn't mean something right so if you put s-e-a-r together with the c-h that makes search I noticed search under my com Combo. Combo in cat log. I think that's what that's supposed to see. I wrote it down in here, but yeah. So if anything happens to me, search under my combo in the catalog. So since I kind of figure out, deciphered that, what that means, I'm going to go check that out. Uh, is it 5253? Five. It's been a while since I played this game. Say, search under combo in catalog. Not sure what that meant. Like, what catalog though? That's the thing. Also, excuse my sniffles. I am sick. <laughs> uh, not enjoying the sickness whatsoever. But, I think I'm gonna play something chill. Maybe figure out these puzzles. The other puzzle that we need to figure out as well, um, I'll remember that one, is the braille. Can I? Oh! I just realized. Camera. I can take pictures on my phone in the game. So I'm gonna go into the library again and take a bunch of pictures um, in there so then I can kind of know where to go from there. There it is. Now the only thing is figuring out what the code for that is. So I'm gonna look into my notes a little bit here. Oh yeah, somebody did leave me a note as well. Uh, this thing. Which is what the braille unlocks. Looks like somebody got to the first step to find Jake's answer at Maxine's. Oh, that's why I couldn't find it? Hold on, let me go back. Maybe that's why I couldn't find it? Because remember that whole thing happened in the library. And then I checked everyone to see where they were, but then I didn't realize I should have checked um, the cop because he wasn't there, and he's still not there. What can I do for you? See you later. It's so quiet. Later. There's like no music. Yeah, I think somebody ripped this. And there's like nothing else. Oh, there's some money though. I have so much coins. I have 101 coins. Holy crap. 
So yeah, I don't think it's here because I checked it. There was nothing here. I'm going to go back to my aunt's house for a minute. I kind of want to set up the soda machine again to check the teacher's lounge to see if there's anything relevant there that I had missed. So I'm going to check the teacher's lounge again. Um, I have to set up the soda machine though. Wow. Such an asshole about it. I hate him. Hey Nancy, need something? Someone set off the alarm on the soda machine again. I'll be right back. Okay, go in here quick. Oh, I need the key. All right. Okay. Um Maintenance room. Nope. I knew it. I knew it was in here. I don't know if we'll need this, but I'm going to take a picture of it. Just in case. Okay. Well, now we know the code for that. Cool. I still don't understand what the other code means. The one that has the every other letter. I assume it has to do something with this locker, but we don't want one. So I don't know which one I should... I mean, I should try to do the one that I know first, but... I'm very spooked to come down here. Okay, so the braille... It's a note. Yeah. N-O-T-E. So we got this. Which is this one, and then O, which is this one, T is this one, E2. Guess it's that guy. That looks ominous, and I don't like it. Ooh. I don't know if I'm prepared for this mentally, emotionally. Oh man. Okay, let's do it. This sounds like the fires of hell coming out of that boiler. Change or something scary. Maxine's diner. Matchstick. I'm gonna be locked out here, aren't I? Nineteen sixty seven. Is that important? Probably if I could look at it. Oh fuck. I uh combination. I hate that noise. I knew coming down here would be a bad idea. Oh, what's this? It's too hot to reach. Case of high temperature condition was you best you blah blah blah. What? Funny. <laughs> oh. Oh, am I putting the gloves on? Do I have them on? It's too hot to reach. Oh. Well, I just have this glove now for no reason. I didn't know I was on a time limit. What am I supposed to do? I have no idea what the password is. Literally zero clue. I'm gonna call Ned. 
I can't call. I can't call for help. That's done. Haven't done that. Did that. Can't check that off yet. Just so happily talking while well, we're about to die. Fuck. I don't know. Oh wait. These are all supposed to be at different levels, I assume. But I don't know the. Wait. 1967, maybe that's the password. 19... 60... Yes! Okay. Um... Ouch, too hot. Oh, I need to back up. Um, because I need that glove. So this was... There, there, there. Okay, let's see if I can remember that. Oh. oh no, it was so close. Okay, one more time. Okay, and then um, pick up this gloves, and then I gotta get this before I go. Uh, okay, that that. So that one. Oh no. Did it? <sighs> that was stressful. Oh my god. Okay. Now I'm gonna figure out what's going on with this, don't I? Right? Put those gloves back. Oh, I can. I can do this now. <gasps> it's a videotape. What? I don't want to go in there. Nancy! Whoa! I'm back outside? Oh, I guess because the thing was broken, I had to climb through the fence to get out. So, how'd your day go with the mysterious note leaving guy? Let's just say he almost took my breath away. Good, so I'm still in the running for you. Uh, bye. Daryl, I'm oh, shit. It. Okay, okay, I get the picture. See you later. I'm about to just be a total dick and be like, bye. I just turn around and leave. Oh, you're back. Okay. Nancy, you look terrible. What happened to you? Are you okay? Somebody set a booby trap for me in the school. I'm pretty sure it was Mitch Dillon who set it up. Okay, we'll handle this and get Mitch off the street. We can't charge him now or we'll blow our cover. But once this investigation is done, I guarantee you he'll pay for this. Daryl mentioned that you had I still don't trust this guy. Week? Yes. I lost my wallet. A lot of my undercover contact information is in the wallet, including yours. You can imagine what would happen if that information fell into the wrong hands. Did you ever find it? It was in my hotel room all along. I think I was drinking too much coffee. It's starting to affect my mind. Bye, Uncle Steve. See you later. I don't trust him. Nope. Don't trust him. Okay, but cool. So, after that death defying experience, we found a videotape. We have, um, oh, we have this matchbook. Did I grab it? What? Where's the matchsticks? I grabbed them. No. Oh, it's right here. Yes. Okay, a weird symbol. Don't know what that means. Um, should we watch the video? I guess. I'm kind of nervous to watch it. Not gonna lie. Ooh, 
I'm afraid it's gonna be something super creepy. Yo! How does he not see a camera right there? The hell? Oh my god, it's Connie. Proof on everybody for everything. Zoom! Is that it? Okay. So Daryl did have those drugs. Connie was a ninja. I don't know. And how was cheating off the, the, the tape proves it all. Okay. I guess we're going back to the school. What do my notes say? Who also set up a boiler trap also left Jake's videotape in a batch book for Maxine that probably has the starting step. Go figure out the fuck that first step thing means. Maybe I'll go talk to the people, see what they have to say. Ah, oh, come on. I wanna go in here. There we go. Hey Nancy, need something? Hmm. I'll talk to you later. Bye, Nancy. I don't know if I wanna say that yet. I'm gonna wait. Okay, what if I gonna call Ned and say what he says? I'm not sure what to do with a secret message in the map drawer. Read every other word and then follow the directions. The answer is a number that Jake would have used several times a week. But it's not this locker combination. Ciao. Bye, Nancy. But what the fuck is the catalog? Like, am I just overthinking it? What's the picture say again? Search under my combo. Under my combo. Is it like on the other side of this? Under my combo. In catalog. Search under my combo in catalog. I don't just call them out on their shit. I'm not into pushy girls. Do me a favor and bother someone else. Jake knew you broke into the drug station. He was blackmailing you, wasn't he? Yeah. He found out I stole the steroids and threatened to turn me over to the cops. It would have meant the end of my football career if I didn't cooperate. Hmm. Well. I assume he wanted to steal him to perform better, so we kind of want to know what he wanted from him. Like, what did he want from you? You name it chauffeur, errand boy, bodyguard. Mm -hmm. He loved ordering me around like I was his slave. Okay. Why did you steal the steroids? I got hurt really bad in a game a few weeks back. Broke four ribs and cracked two others. I had to keep playing even though I was hurt. I needed to impress the scouts. Then I started taking steroids. It wasn't worth it because I was still in pain and all my free time was spent playing errand boy for Jake. Did you kill him? I'm not a killer, Nancy. I didn't do it. The last thing Jake had me do was deliver a note to Daryl Gray. It was in a sealed envelope, so I couldn't read it. My bet is Jake was blackmailing Daryl. I'll talk to you later. Bye. Interesting. Okay, well, let's just go and confront them all, except for what's his face, because I already do. It's your turn. I'm coming for you, girl. Yeah, you. Yeah, you. Hey, Nancy, oh. need something? I know you're the unknown winner of that judo competition. Jake Rogers had it all on videotape. Yes, Nancy. I'm the mysterious winner of the men's tournament. It wasn't easy for me, and I'm proud of what I did. Did you kill Jake to stop him from blackmailing you? 
Are you crazy? Of course not. I didn't kill Jake. Hmm. Both don't sound very good. But this one Jake makes more sense. Jake to expose you, maybe even make you lose your black belt, and he forced you to break your date with Daryl. Life would have been so easy with him out of the way. I didn't kill Jake. <laughs> See you later. See you later. Bye, Nancy. <laughs> okay. So now we gotta talk to Daryl. Things are unfolding. What can I do for you? It's you! You killed him! Hulk Sanchez said he saw you delivering an envelope to Jake. Okay, so I gave him an envelope. Big deal. It was about a school project I'm working on. What is it with all these questions? I'm really starting to wonder who you are exactly, Nancy Drew. I'm out of here. If Maxine drops by, make up a good excuse about why I had to leave. No. See you around, Nancy. Why did I do that? Ooh, he got out of there in a hurry. Hi, Nancy. I found the videotape Jake made. It shows some students that Jake was blackmailing. Was one of the students Vicky Gray? No. That's surprising. My intuition told that Blondie Burger Boy is involved in it somehow. Good lead, but we really need to find that journal of Jake's. I found a notepad in the library that seems like a message from Jake. Really? Tell me more. It says, things to remember me. And seems to give clues about the answer to my fate lies in a box. This is the best lead we've had. I think I could break the case. Follow whatever directions he gave to find this box. His journal could be in there. Excellent work, Nancy Drew. But remember, you need to keep a low profile and be careful. Okay. Bye, Uncle Steve. See you later. I still hate him. He's so creepy. Okay, um, I'm gonna call Ned again. <laughs> it's probably gonna be the same thing. Hi, Nancy. Ugh. Ciao. Bye, Nancy. Okay, the catalog, the catalog. So I was just sitting here trying to figure out where I've seen this symbol before, and I realized it's, um, a symbol for a planet, or whatever. It's Mercury, and I realized the periodic table of elements has mercury, 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 and I need to, I don't think I wrote it down which one it is, but I think if I know which one that is, I'll know where to start with decoding that uh, periodic table clue. So I'm gonna go to the library, Fuck it up again, and we're gonna see if I can figure it out. The first step, yep. Okay, so let's see. I'm just gonna look up what the symbol for Mercury is on my phone. Okay, like it's really hard to read it, it's really blurry. It's hard for me to see what it is. HG, right? That's what it says. So where is that on here? Right here. HG. So now what the hell does that mean? What did it say on this? HG. That's the first one. Uh, I'll want to write that down, but I don't have a pen anywhere near me. HG. So that is on this anyway. Is it not even a thing on here? Hold up. H G. That doesn't make any sense if it's not. Well, those two are the only ones that are red for some reason. I don't understand. The elements tell the order. If H G is the first one. Does that mean it goes like this? And then back up? So that's the only thing that makes sense. What does that mean? Oh, man, there's gotta be something else. Oh, money. I feel like there's something over here because this is all Jake stuff just hanging out here. 
You know what I mean? Like, it's weird. There's gotta be more to this library than art meets the eye here. I'm gonna check his locker again, I guess. I literally don't know. What else to look? Nothing. <sighs> okay, I don't know this one. Um, it's taking a bit more confusing turn than I thought. There must be something I'm still missing because I I started the I start out the periodic table at that one point, but I don't know where to go from there. Like I assume the order like I already have them ordered, so I assume that's already good, but I don't understand what I'm supposed to do with those. Um I feel like I'm missing something, there's still something I need to get to be able to figure it out because I honestly um don't know and I don't know if it's because I'm sick and I'm sleepy and my brain's just not working so um I'm gonna leave this episode here this was a little bit of a longer episode it's probably gonna be cut down pretty short but some exciting things did happen we got blown up a few times um but we did find a videotape and we did see that they other students were guilty of something so he was blackmailing them so they all have just become a bit more of a suspect. Daryl's also acting super weird too, so that's a little bit strange. Um, so yeah, hopefully in the next episode I'll be able to decode that. Um, I'll be able to decode that uh, periodic puzzle because yeah, that's just really stumping me right now. I don't know where to go with forward with that. So um, anyways guys, thanks so much for watching. If you like this video, make sure to hit the like button down below. Um, and subscribe to my channel if you like my content. Also hit the notification bell so you can be notified when I post. If you want to follow me on social media, my links will be linked down below in the description box. As well as my Twitch, which I stream on sometimes. Um, so that's linked as down there as well. But other than that guys, I'm gonna go to bed. Thank you so much for watching this video and I'll see you all in the next one. Bye! <laughs>